Good day, friend. Gordo here. In this presentation, we're going to do a bit of due diligence on Boardwalk Real Estate Investment Trust. And just before we begin, here's the safe harbor. This presentation is produced and published on and around March 1st, 2023. It includes timely information that can be quickly rendered obsolete. It's meant for education and information purposes only, and the source of most of the information is Boardwalk REIT. This is not an offer to purchase securities. Items presented here may not be suitable for everyone. Rates change, values fluctuate. Please consult an experienced qualified licensed professional prior to investing to ensure that your investments are part of a comprehensive plan designed to help you and your family meet your long-term financial goals and objectives. Also, if and when recommending products and planning strategies, broad tax and legal issues may be discussed. Nothing should be construed as tax or legal advice. There, now that we got the jam on that toast, let's move forward. Here's our agenda. We'll give a bit of background about Boardwalk and the people involved in leadership. We'll review the latest operating results as well as Boardwalk's potential as a long-term investment. Boardwalk is a $7 billion enterprise. They own some 209 properties, which house 34,000 residential rental units. At the end of the latest quarter, nearly all of those units were occupied. Although they own real estate across the country, nearly three quarters of Boardwalk's rental properties are located in the province of Alberta and Saskatchewan. And most of those properties are located in Edmonton, Alberta. So let's take a look at the type of assets they own and manage. We'll start with the Brio in Calgary. The Brio was a joint venture between Boardwalk and RioCan. It's located in the heart of Calgary, near shopping centers and near transit corridors. Their properties include bright modern living spaces complete with amenities, including gyms and workout spaces, and social and meeting spaces. We also see those qualities in their development pipeline, like this project on 45 Railroad in Brampton, Ontario, located just outside of Toronto. Again, the residential towers include bright livable spaces with amenities. This particular development is in progress and includes 365 suites and 10,700 square feet of retail space within two high-rise towers located above a three-story podium. And we see those same modern living qualities with their recent acquisitions. Boardwalk acquired this 158-unit complex in August of last year. It was purchased for $42 million and they assumed a mortgage of $29.2 million, which matures in 2026 and is locked in at 3.18%. Now let's pull back the curtain and review Boardwalk's management. Boardwalk CEO and board chair is Sam Coleus. He and his brother Van founded Boardwalk in 1984. Today, they're surrounded by a team of managers who help out with the heavy lifting. Let's take a look briefly at Boardwalk's history. In 1984, Sam and his brother Van purchased a multi-unit residence while Sam was studying civil engineering at the University of Calgary. They sold that complex, but later developed an expertise in retrofitting residences constructed in the 1950s and in the 1960s. They listed Boardwalk on the Alberta Exchange in 1994, and they converted to a real estate investment trust in 2004. The business has been in operation for nearly 40 years. And speaking of numbers and years, let's review their reported figures. Here are some of Boardwalk's operational highlights over the past five quarters. Revenue is up 8.5%. Net asset value or book value per unit is up just under 7%. And the partnership currently produces roughly $40 million of funds from operations every 90 days. Since 2018, revenue is up 13.8%. Funds from operations are up 40.4%, and unit holder equity is up nearly 
And after years of weathering the pandemic uncertainty, Boardwalk seems to have normalized growth once again. Now let's look at this from a business perspective. A person investing $100,000 of their capital into Boardwalk would have obtained 1,694 units based on the closing price on February 28, 2023. If the reported values are used, an investor would have received roughly $1.30 of equity for every dollar invested. Based on recent operating results, that $100,000 of capital would generate roughly $18,300 of revenue and about $5,300 of funds from operations, or about a dollar, or pardon me, $150 of distributions per month. Now let's examine the prospective opportunity an investment in Boardwalk might represent. Here are a couple of charts showing unit price trading values since January 1st and over the last six months. I won't dwell too much on these charts except to say Boardwalk has been trading well below its net asset value of about $70 a unit. And on November 22nd, they renewed their unit repurchase program. They're authorized to repurchase and retire up to 10% of their outstanding units, and they can do this at a discount to book value or net asset value. That bodes well for long-term shareholders. Boardwalk continues to offer desirable living space in warm neighborhoods that value friendship and community. They offer living space at affordable and highly competitive rental rates. And most of their properties are located in Alberta, which currently boasts the highest interprovincial immigration rates in the country. They're also experiencing a high number of immigrants coming from international locations. Finally, on February 28th, the Alberta government announced noteworthy increases to their 2023 budget. Royalties from oil, gas, and other resources are once again buoying the economy after years of depressed commodity prices. I would expect the Alberta economy to rev up over the foreseeable future. And now it's time to review. Boardwalk Real Estate Investment Trust offers investors an opportunity to invest in some quality residential properties, predominantly located in Alberta and Saskatchewan. They're managed by a competent team of individuals led by founder Sam Coleus, and they're well positioned to capitalize on rising commodity prices and a growing energy sector. It's why Boardwalk is one of the holdings in our insured real estate equity portfolio. For more information, you can visit my webpage at www.think-income.com or you can contact me, Gord, at gord at think-income.com. Thanks for watching. And if you found this presentation informative, please give it a thumbs up. And please remember, stay safe, stay sage, and stay well.